Okay, so envisioning your goal, this is just using mental visualizations to visualize your goals occurring ahead of time. So there's a bunch of research on this stuff, which I won't bother going into. Um, I've already mentioned it like in, like if I train you guys in the gym, like I've, I've mentioned it before. So what you're doing is, uh, so you can do this throughout the day, but we'll, we'll keep it simple and just t stick with when you're reading your goals, doing your morning routine, or if you're reading it at night, it would mean that if you've got your goals there and you've got like three goals or five goals, or it could be fitness goals or life goals, you're at least allocating like at least a minute, maybe even two minutes to when, when you read that goal. So you're reading the goal and you read it and you, you, you then take some time to visualize what it's actually like to be there. Like as if it was happening right now, as if you already had it. So if it was like a weight loss goal, for example, you don't imagine, you don't focus on what you have right now. You visualize yourself at the end point, like you've achieved your target weight and you're in different fitting clothes and what does that feel like? And that feels amazing. So you're using your imagination to artificially create a reality for your, your subconscious mind. Your subconscious mind can't tell the difference between what's real and what you imagine. So what you're doing is you're just imagining a new reality. And so when you imagine that new reality, your brain thinks, oh, this has already happened. So then it means that you can go after it. With easy, it's actually easier to go after that goal if your subconscious mind thinks it's already happened. So the example I've got in the text is, um, like you've brushed your teeth so many times before, you don't agonize over brushing your teeth, you just do it because your brain's just like, yeah, man, I just, I've done that like a thousand times, like no worries. You'll brush your teeth while you're doing something else. Like that's how confident it is to brush your teeth. But if someone stuck you in a helicopter with like the two minutes of instruction on how to fly a helicopter and was like, go, like you'd be like, oh, like you'd be freaking out because like your, your brain's like, nah, man, we haven't been here before. Like we don't know any of this stuff. Like um, it, you'd wig out like, and so it would mean that your actions while you were trying to fly it would be jerky, not sure. Um, you could imagine what that would be like. You'd be super hesitant, like you might still be doing it, but you'd just be really ah, not doing it in a very confident way. So by visualizing your goals ahead of time, it trains your subconscious mind to think like, oh, okay, this has already happened. And so it means that you can go after them easier. It just makes the path there smoother. And um, again, it just helps to reinforce to yourself, this is where I'm going, this is what I'm doing. Um, again, that front sight focus, like focusing on this is what's happening, I'm doing this. Forget about everything else, I'm doing this. So it's just reinforcing this concept um, like multiple times throughout the day.